Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, it's been about a month and a week, so about five weeks or so, uh, since I updated you last on my washi in ground. Um, so it's grown another frond, as you can see. So the frond in the last video was this one that grew out, um, and then it grew this one over here. Uh, surprisingly smaller than the first frond, which is odd to me, but maybe that's just par for the course, I'm not sure. I would say it's maybe two inches, two inches smaller, um, give or take. And then I got another spear coming out here. I actually marked it today. It hasn't done any growing. Well, I just marked it this morning, so it's not gonna grow much in eight hours. Um, anyway, this this spear is half halfway through, so I suspect by the end of the season I'm gonna have five, maybe six fronds. Um, all in all, I'm gonna call that a win. Now that's the uh, the washi update, and uh, I put in some new mulch. The trunk has gotten bigger. Um, it's funny, it's beefing out. Um, but it's staying about the same in terms of uh, width just past the uh, base of the trunk here. But the base of the trunk has definitely gotten bigger since I put it in ground. Anyway, that's uh, the washi update. Uh, I'll show you a different washi too, actually. the um, In the washi seedlings that Eric Thompson gave me, um, he had, there were three three of them. Uh, they were, I think, a two-strap seedling. Um, and this one blew up. I actually got rid of the other two. I had all three in this pot. And two of them were like this big, give or take. And then this one just was the biggest out of the out of the three. So I figured I would call the other two, uh, give it its own pot, and let it start growing because it's growing quick. Um, it uh, I think it's growing two fronds. Um, since you can see another one starting right here. So that's my other washi. Now we got going. Hopefully a squirrel or raccoon doesn't bite the base of this one off. Anyway, take care, guys. Have a good weekend.